not something I'd normally review because I'd find it quite boring to be honest. Uh, I got Tamiya's Super Glue CA Cement. I've seen this a few times in the past, just, just dismissed it because I saw Tamiya Cement, you know, it's no different to Super Glue like such you get in bottles and what have you. Um, very kindly sent a couple of samples by Matthew, a uh, member of ISM, as I said before, thanks very much for sending me those, Matthew. Um, opened it up, put it all together, absolutely loved it. One of the best things I bought, well, not bought, but been given for a long, long time. Uh, really, uh, really impressed by it, how it works. Nice and simple. I've got one here. It's very, very nearly empty. Um, so I'm going to open this one up and we'll start with this one. I've literally, I'm struggling to get it out of this now. I've used it that much um, that it's nearly, very nearly run out. So nicely packaged. Tamiya's typical packaging. Um, it looks very strange when you look at it, thinking what the hell is that grey thing in there. So we'll open it up and have a look. So on the back are instructions, all in Japanese, but you can get the gist of what you've got. I'll see if I can remember what I did. Inside, you get your little grey dispenser. We have a lid one end with two precision tips in. Put those in shot just there. So very, very precise. Literally one use only. I use the others once. There's no way of cleaning them out, unfortunately. Not that I know of, anyway. Uh, you've got your dispenser, two buttons either side, and the base that comes off. So, what you do next? Packaging. You've got a tube, if we can get it out, super glue, and a pin cap as well. So, what do you do? As you can see, CA super glue, Tammy cement. What I did was snip the top off. I admit I did it a little bit too short on my one, so I'm going to cut it a little bit further away this time. We've got a little bit of super glue to come out, so we'll wipe that off. Then it's a case. You're probably better thinking about it, putting this through before you open it up, but I didn't think of that really. Never mind. So there we go, push through, as so. Put the base on. And it's out the top. You get the little needle nozzle, so you can see it's a little orange nozzle with a needle in. That literally pushes in the hole, if you can find it. Like so. And see it's up ready. Then put the cap on, you've got a nice, neat CA dispenser. I can see, you've got precision tips. I'm not going to put them on because I don't want to waste them. They literally slide over the top, so it gives you a real nice, flexible, precise little unit to use. If we grab something to super glue, I'll grab the old packaging. Ah, we've got a little bit of plastic up there, scrap from something. I know it's not scrap, <laughs> part of a model. We've got a bit of a um, photo of it, so that it's scrap. So, literally, take the nozzle, two little buttons either side, they squeeze the tube inside. So you can get a precise little amount like I've just got there. Pop whatever you need to stick on. Position it, job done. It's nice thin super glue, it's not overly thin. So it doesn't dry instantly. Probably get a couple of seconds to manipulate parts. Um, and it glues very nice. So like I said, I've been using it now for probably, it's gotta be a month now, I think Matthew sent it me. Um, Really can't fault it. I've used that other one, so I'm onto this one now. Absolutely superb. You can't currently get them in the UK, unfortunately. Um, I think Matthew got them in Hobby Link Japan. I'll be putting an order in very soon, and I think Lee will be because I promised Lee this one. But uh, sorry, Lee, I think I have to keep it because I've got none left. Uh, so I think me and Lee will be putting an order in together to get some. Um, great little tool. I'm not sure the price. I don't think they're expensive though. Uh, I think off the top of my head, they're about three pounds each. So you know. I know you can get cheaper super glue and power land and that, but they don't last very long and I've been using this for a long time now. With that little cap, it really does seal it well if I can get it back in. There we go. Helps have a look properly when I'm doing it. So another cracking bit of kit. You know, very uh, well thought out. You can squeeze as hard or as soft as you like. It were, pardon me. Uh, to get as much or as little super glue out. And like I say, with these precision tips, you can get right in there 
and apply the glue where you want. So ideally, if you're doing photo etching, large, you know, uh, large quantity together. But like I say, they are single use only. I use mine within a couple of days. It would be nice if Tammy did these separately so you could buy them in bulk because they are very, very handy to add onto it um, and use it. So there we go, Tamiya's CA dispenser. Short review, may not be the most interesting. I think it's a cracking little bit of kit and I'll certainly be getting more of them. A uh, lot easier, a lot cleaner and simpler than using a bottle with a little tub to dispense it in. You can literally, I, what I tend to do if you watch my videos is squeeze it out onto a cocktail stick and pop it on, put the lid back on. Job done. So there we go, another review, another good bit of kit.